Hi guys, so today I'm going to talk about a very interesting topic such as master degree in cybersecurity. There are lots of master degrees in cybersecurity in Europe and uh, out of Europe, but uh, specifically, master degree in cybersecurity is Dali University of Technology in Estonia is a great program and basically it combines uh, studies in the two universities, the University of Tartu and Tallinn University of Technology. Uh, and after that you will get a degree from the two universities, from those two universities. And um, first of all, uh, it consists of two years, master's degree two years, and uh, four semesters, uh, respectively. And the first semester, it's a semester where you will be deciding uh, which specialization you want to choose. So you will be uh, cho choosing different uh, kind of subjects from different specializations in cybersecurity, such as human aspects of cybersecurity, cryptography, or math course, if you will not pass crypto math course, math exam. And uh, then you will have also cybersecurity technologies and those bunch of uh, subjects. You can also take something additional, but I suggest you not to take something additional, just to take uh, compulsory courses and to figure out what you really want to do, what you really like. On the uh, second semester, you will have uh, already to decide which destination you want to go, and then you will be studying in Tartu, in the University of Tartu. So you need to go every week. Once a week, you need to go to the University of Tartu to accomplish uh, lectures and practical courses, uh, practical uh, lessons uh, uh, at the university. Uh, or you can live in Tartu and uh, uh, yeah, for this uh, six months and to study there. And during this semester, you will have more deeper uh, subjects, uh, such as. Uh, if you choose crypto, you will go to cryptology, applied crypto. If you choose some um, uh, digital forensics, you can find digital forensics courses there or cybersecurity, it's in general. So you will have three specializations, basically. It's digital forensics, cybersecurity and cryptography. You have to choose one of those, what you want to study and uh, basically in the end to write your thesis about. Uh, so cybersecurity is more general program. If you want to learn more general things, you will choose cybersecurity, cryptography, uh, subjects related protocol, uh, protocols, and different crypto systems. It's also a very technical topic. And digital forensics, digital uh, forensics investigations, procedures, labs. Uh, um, it's all those uh, things that are very applicable in a market in a cybersecurity uh, field, and basically you will be demanded in any way if you will be doing this kind of stuff. It's very good to know and to have. And uh, after accomplishing this semester, you will go. You will move to the third semester. Uh, basically, third semester is a, an opportunity for you to decide which topic. Which, cyber, which topic you will be writing your thesis about. So you will have a special, specific subject, master thesis uh, seminar, and uh, you will have to develop your idea and your research proposal in that subject and in that course. And uh, there are also some additional subjects that you can take. I highly recommend you to take a tech and defense course, which is really good if you want to go into penetration testing. And uh, also, uh, there are some uh, uh, advanced crypto courses and so on, uh, which are also very uh, deep research theoretical uh, uh, subjects. Uh, it's uh, it's a good it's a good opportunity to learn more. And uh, on the fourth semester, you will have to write your thesis. Yeah, to be honest, it takes four months approximately. In average, it's like to write your thesis every day during four months and to have constant feedback from your supervisor, which you have to choose as well before, um, and um, agree on your topic and on your schedule, how, you, how you're gonna write your thesis and uh, deadlines to show uh, to your supervisor so he can read uh, uh, your thesis. And then you will have to submit it and to defend it. Uh, which takes also uh, some uh, some amount of time uh, because uh, opponent your opponent has, has to read your thesis and 
uh, has to give you a uh, good feedback before you will uh, submit final version of your thesis and then of course defense so i think this program gives you a very good solid base knowledge uh, about cybersecurity and those three specializations which i was talking about and uh, also it's a good preparation for your future interviews in a companies and cybersecurity for cybersecurity positions uh, which you're gonna choose so I think it's a very, very, very good thing to put on your CV and of course you will be very confident talking about cybersecurity related topics on the interview with, or with different kind of people on the different conferences so you can easily pick up this subject and to talk about after you will finish this degree. Of course, depends which way you will go, more technical or more or less technical. I think uh, it's a very good opportunity and um, for uh, this video is especially for uh, future uh, students or students who want to decide to study master degree in cybersecurity and they hesitate or they don't know or they are not sure I suggest you just to try yourself and it's a very great opportunity to get more experience such a great country and great university and uh, you will get uh, another level of uh, understanding and knowledge uh, about the current uh, situation in cybersecurity, and uh, then you can leverage it in different ways as you want. So, future students, I suggest you to apply to this university. I suggest you to try yourself, try your best, and uh, let me know if you have any questions about application process. In the next video, I can give more in-depth uh, tips and tricks about how it used to be when I was applying, and I can compare with how is it now and uh, basically I can make some analysis based on that knowledge. So it was a great pleasure to talk to you and I hope you will uh, find this video very useful and uh, it will help you to decide with your future career path in cybersecurity and what you want to do and it was a great pleasure. Thank you very much and see you soon. Bye.